According to information published by the German newspaper Bild on September 15, 2024, Germany approved the sale of advanced RCH-155 155mm wheeled SELF propelled artillery systems to Qatar. In return, Qatar will hand over 12 of its 24 Panzer Hobbits 2000, PZH-2000, self-propelled howitzers to Ukraine. The vehicles will be brought up to operational standards in Germany before being delivered to Ukrainian forces. This move signifies a strategic realignment and an escalation in international support for Ukraine amid its ongoing conflict with Russia. Qatar's acquisition of the RCH-155 artillery systems allows it to modernize its artillery capabilities with cutting-edge technology. Simultaneously, the transfer of PZH-2000 tracked self-propelled howitzers to Ukraine is expected to substantially enhance Ukraine's artillery strength due to the system's advanced features, such as high rate of fire, precision targeting, and long-range capabilities. The RCH-155 is a highly advanced artillery system developed by Germany's Krauss Maffei Wegmann, KMW. Mounted on a boxer-wheeled armored vehicle, it offers increased mobility and automation compared to traditionally tracked howitzers. The system features a 155mm L-52 gun and can fire precision-guided munitions at distances exceeding 40 kilometers, approximately 25 miles. The purchase reflects Qatar's commitment to modernizing its military forces with state-of-the-art equipment. The deal also strengthens defense ties between Qatar and Germany, potentially paving the way for future military technology and training collaborations. Before the Panzer Hobbit's 2000 howitzers are handed over to Ukraine, they will undergo a comprehensive upgrade process in Germany. This refurbishment is expected to include technical overhauls, software updates and modifications to meet the Ukrainian military's specific requirements. German defense contractors like KMW and Rainmetal will likely oversee the process to ensure the equipment is delivered in optimal condition. The Panzer Hobbit's 2000 has been a mainstay in modern artillery since its introduction in the late 1990s. Known for its rapid-fire capability and long-range precision, it has been utilized by several NATO countries. Qatar originally purchased 24 units to enhance its artillery forces. The decision to part with half of its inventory suggests a strategic trade-off to acquire more advanced systems like the RCH-155. Germany's role in both supplying Qatar with new artillery systems and upgrading the howitzers for Ukraine underscores its active involvement in international defense matters. This dual engagement reflects Germany's strategic interests and its stance on supporting Ukraine. Qatar has generally maintained a neutral stance regarding the conflict between Ukraine and Russia, often advocating for diplomatic solutions and peaceful dialogue. Qatar's foreign policy traditionally emphasizes mediation and conflict resolution. The nation has engaged in various diplomatic efforts in the Middle East and beyond but has not publicly aligned itself militarily in the Ukraine-Russia conflict. Any significant shift in Qatar's stance, especially involving military support, would likely be accompanied by official statements and widespread media coverage. If confirmed, Qatar's decision to purchase RCH-155 artillery systems and supply Ukraine with half of its PZH-2000 howitzers represents a noteworthy development in international efforts to support Ukraine. The move not only aids Ukraine's military capabilities but also reflects the complex web of global alliances and defense strategies influencing the region's security landscape.